Well, folks, we are back again after some just absolutely devastating news last round. We lost to Joanna <laughs> after a brief resurrection. Um, but the run's not dead yet. It, you know, I was feeling very doom and gloom about it, but I'm glad I walked away for for a little bit uh, because I still got I've still got an elite Pike team in Olin. Um, I have no reason to think that their run is over. It just sucked to lose uh, a favorite. Uh, especially on somewhere called Ska Play, like, that should have been my favorite place ever, but there we are with a devastating loss instead. Okay, this island seems pretty straightforward. We've got one uh, entry point here, as well as one here and one here, so we basically have three spots we need to watch overall. So we've got our top archer, we've got our two elite sword people, and we've got Olwyn. So I think that that's about as much as we could ask for here. Um, I think at the end of the day, like, what I really want is to just complete this run. I think I'm trying to get too fancy with systems I don't necessarily understand in full. Um, for example, you know, resting certain teams, trying to do multiple islands in one turn. I'm not sure that that's the kind of thing I need to be thinking about yet. Uh, right now, let's just finish the run, and let's not get too wild. Um, the other thing was is that I very clearly got distracted uh, as though I was a baby and somebody was jingling keys in my face last round when um, I had that archer that <laughs> survived and I couldn't find a way to kill. Um, I think that that was kind of me thinking in a more tower defense way of like, Oh, the next wave doesn't come until I kill the first the wave that I'm on, which is clearly not the case. Um, so that was obviously dumb, but I've learned my lesson now. Don't let myself get very incredibly easily distracted. Um, and other than that, we should hopefully be okay. Uh, let's let our archers work over here and let our pikes uh, continue to work on these folks when they try to come up. The other thing... Oh, okay. Hold the phones. I did not think that that was a way up. Well, hey, now we know. I should have noticed that, but I did not. Okay, well, I'm lucky that I've still got living archers. That much is for sure. Um, because that could have been real bad. Have them swap positions quickly there. That was great. Okay, so I've got shield folks coming up over here. I think that's generally just fine. Uh, we'll keep this formation for now. I don't think they have anywhere to go other than straight up this hill, which um, isn't like incredible, but also isn't really a big problem for us. Yeah, they've got nowhere else to be. So now we can get our pikes working away over here. I mean, oh, don't let that guy throw a thing. Yeah, okay. And now you guys aren't really working on anything at the moment. You can get over here. We'll get these guys. Maybe what we'll do actually even is go... Is run them down here very briefly just to put a mine down and then get them back up top. You know, just to just to slow them. And again, our pikes, uh, the people's weapon, as a as Alex put it, will continue to do their work over here uh, and make it essentially impossible for these guys to get up. While my archers uh, slowly finish them off. Great. That was fantastic. I love having Putnam here for all the extra gold. That's a big help. I'm glad we didn't lose Putnam. And we just have to keep our core team good, as far as I'm concerned. Um, I think that's really the move. We are last stand, okay, so that's the end of the run. I guess we're gonna see that. Um, now, what is this insanity? Let's just do next turn, obviously. Um, we need to get all of our people back. Now, what can we upgrade? We have eight, that gives them a charge, which I'm not too concerned about. 
Uh, none of this really helps a ton at this point. Maybe more mines would be nice, but that's 14, so I can't really get there yet. Everyone else is fully upgraded. Joanna, my sweet, <laughs> my sure-footed Joanna, um, I miss you, but I'm not sure that you're of much help. Or, well, you would be of help if I could get you back, but I can't. Um, let's look at Hester here. This seems insanely hard. Um, I'm not going to worry about that right now. Let's look at Nolsoy over here. Looks kind of similarly hard, but at least people are being funneled to um, where I need them. I think, yeah, the most useful thing I could basically do at this point is probably just continue to upgrade mines. Um, I believe this is probably the team I'm going to be running with to finish the run if I can finish it, so... Let's just let's just do it. Um, again, okay. Don't let don't let the game jingle keys in my face. Don't fall for that. Um, and I have to get creative with how I use uh, my pikes as well as my archers. Um, I also have to be very wary of other archers coming in because now I know that like. If I don't have archers to deal with them, they can kind of just be an irritating little jerk uh, out on these peninsulas where I may not necessarily be able to reach them. Ooh, flanking archers are doing great work over there. Let's have my swords run in to help. Okay, that's great. So now here I'm looking at this. I don't think they can go anywhere except for right into these pikes. So I may be wrong about that. If I am, let's just get my sword and shield kind of standing over here. But it looks to me like they're going to have to do this. Um, right? Yeah, I think so. Okay, we've got another little sneaky boat over here. I'm going to stick with my gut that says they're going to they're gonna have to go through the pikes. And yeah, just keep my, keep my pikes doing their work there. That seems like they're pretty much going to be... Uh, undefeated champions of the world on that tiny little rock and now these guys are gonna do a do the classic pincer maneuver well that's annoying but it's fine um some more pikes coming in let's just keep uh oh okay so we've got now we've got another crew over there which I believe is actually less threatening to me because they don't have shields. So let's leave uh, our shield guys to fight them for now and we'll let the pikes hopefully keep them at bay. I may actually be able to bring the pikes over, yeah. Because I've got enough units that the pikes I think can just help over here. We'll get our archers in the space, and now these guys are going to have to go through this way, which I think is fine. I can kind of see how this is probably going to play out for me. Yeah, that was just super good. Um, these guys don't really have anywhere to go, again, except for right into my team, who's already ready and waiting. So this seems like a good, good enough setup. I, like, all these guys are pretty whatever because, again, there is nothing they can do. Um, I can send these guys in just to be annoying, and I'm going to drop, like, a mine in here. But I don't even think it's necessary. Just got to keep my eye open for other boats. Don't see any. So they got nowhere to go. They're just going to get decimated by that, and then they've got nothing left but to... Uh, get poked to death so that was clean that was very clean this was like the easy version of the other island i think that i had the choice between um yeah giving all the having all these little paths made it very easy for uh, the pikes to do their their grim task so kniver rock and then we're at the last stand look at this bloody path we've taken from malmo holy heck what is that? Oh, no, I don't need to. Oh, that's what the checkpoint means. Okay. <clears throat> so it means I could go back and like get my, get Joanna again <laughs> and then go the rest of this way. Oh, 
I shouldn't have done that because I haven't advanced my turn yet, but let me just look at the... Doesn't seem too crazy. Two entry points over here, one up here, and then obviously one thing down there. Um, we will upgrade, actually. Let's go to mod and get max level mines just so we have another one. Um, and then we're looking at Niver here with my regular team. I think this should be fine. I probably am going to want to just sort of keep the pikes back and sort of have my units... Like, the thing I essentially think is that my archers are going to be running back and forth to help wherever they can, and my pikes are probably just going to be staying up here to hopefully just poke guys off of this one way or the other. Um, so yeah, over here, how do I even get arrows on these guys? Probably here, and then this, and then I can do like a, actually because I don't have anyone else coming, I can do like a little bait maneuver with my purple team, where I can hopefully get them to come up the way I want them to come up by then fleeing, by fleeing back. They can chase chase my guys up into the pikes, is, was the hope. <laughs> yeah, it kind of worked. Um, okay, we've got, got a lot of guys coming in over here, so we're gonna have to get all of our folks down, but again, I think I'm just going to kind of keep my pikes up top. Yeah, they did really well against them, and now they can just come over here and help. <laughs> Have like 10 guys. Okay, now I'm definitely bringing my pikes down. Sorry, pikes down, them up. I'm going to bring them over. So again, let's just get our pikes kind of Actually, probably the thing to do is to fully just choke them off like this, because they have to come towards my house. So I just need to make sure nobody comes in the other way, but I think that this is honestly totally fine. Yeah, that was looking way worse than it was. Um, okay, so now I really need to think. These guys are landing here. By and large, I think the bigger force is coming this way, so let's get the archers up on these walls, and then these guys are just going to have to deal. Um... We can get a mine put down perhaps here. Um, and then aside from that, we're just going to guard the house, hopefully. Um, these guys, we really hope, come up the easy way. I guess if they don't, going there is actually the most effective maneuver. Now these guys can run around this way and help. Um, the pike, those guys got... S they tried to flank the pikes, but it didn't work. Um... These guys just let everyone run past, apparently, which is incredibly annoying, but they did it. So now we've got people coming on this side. Let's get our archers kind of onto high ground here, I guess. Um, and then we're just going to have to get everybody else uh, up and being prepared. Because if they try to go around this way, then I want them to run into my shields. And yeah, this is, seems to be going pretty well. Okay, we've got big archers coming. Uh, so now I think what I really need to do is just speed this up with the fight. Um, I want to get my p pikes back in position here as well as... I need to get these guys going back now. I think that that's pretty much it. These guys all really need to get around. And I want my pikes to just be in kind of protected area. Okay, so now these guys are going to be real annoying. Let's hope that they can handle on their own over here. Yeah, that was easy. They look good. Oh, no, no, no. Wait, why are you guys just letting this happen? Why do they always do that shit? Oh, it drives me insane. They just, they seem to just love to let guys just walk right by them. Okay, so they're going that way. Which is fine. Once again, we're just going to have to set up in such a way that they can't do much about that. Have them switch. Because I think that's the most obvious path for them. Yeah, they tried to split, but that's not going to go well for them. 
I think we're pretty much all good. Yeah, okay. Not too bad. Again, you, when you've got elevation like this, it's nothing crazy. Um, that split path at the back was annoying, but you could kind of always just back up to the house and make sure that that gets done. So I think this might... No, I'm not gonna... This feels good, but I don't want to call anything early. <laughs> that would be absolutely foolish of me to say that this is a run. Because that looks like it's gonna be hard as hell. Um, okay, what can I upgrade? I've got 10. Is there any, much I can do? I guess I can get mod this extra. There is some elevation there, so I guess getting mod this plunge ability is good. Barrett already has it. Putnam has their ability. It's not their best one, but maybe I'll add to the volley. That's probably my next upgrade, is to get 10 for if I even have enough to do that. I don't... I can't see myself using the charge, so... Okay, we've got a lot of narrow paths here. That's no problem. We, we like seeing those. Um... Strong archers and strong dudes, so I really have to be protective of Olwyn. I, he's going to have to just bail the hell out if anything starts to look fishy. But um, other than that, I think we're pretty, pretty good. It's just going to be a real careful maneuvering. Don't be afraid to let the game really slow down here. Okay, so we've got... Got shields we got pikes going we've got big archers which i think we just kind of have to set up like this our pikes are in a our pikes are in a fine place i'd love to move them in one spot but we're not gonna get that freely i don't think I really want to get onto that heavy archer. Yeah. Um, now you guys are gonna run around. Nice job, Pikes. That was really good work. Uh, let's get these guys over. Actually, let's just get our... Hmm, it really depends where they land, huh? Let's get our archers over here to hopefully get some work done on those big guys. Oh, they got caught by the big guys. Oh no, they're really getting caught by the big guys. Okay. I'm going to actually replenish them really early here. Um, I'm going to have to get these guys fighting over here, I think, too, just to save that house. And I'm going to try and get these dudes right on the, just right on top of the big archers. And let's get these guys over here poking at them. Okay, so I still have my archer crew. I really, really need to keep that in mind. Let's get these guys here and these guys over here aggro them so that they don't start looking the other way, and then that's good. That's perfect timing for my archers to come back. Okay, I see we've got a big archer coming in on the other side. That's not a huge concern for me. Um, these guys should absolutely stay here, and I guess we just have to bring these guys around, and same with these, to defend... Uh, yes, okay, they did defend. They were just on time to defend against the big archer there. Okay, again, elite shields are doing their work. Now they just hammer on that dude. Alright, big guys coming in. I guess we just get everyone over here. I think now is the time to start laying mines, too. I just need to keep that in mind that I can do that. Um, let me get those guys here. And here, and then let's move you here. And let's keep our archers in position. Oh no, wait. Wait, hold on, hold on. Pikes, gotta get back, gotta get back, Pikes. Pikes, you gotta get back. Oh, this is looking real bad. Okay, um, I've still got a couple pikes here and everyone else is 
Still, everyone is still alive. Um, okay, yeah, you baited them over this way. That's okay. And now you've got one mine left. Get it down. Okay. Oh, I lost Olwyn, didn't I? That was Olwyn. Shit. Oh, this is real bad. Um, I've got... These are just... This guy's got nothing. This guy's completely worthless to me. This is one shield. I think... Is this... Oh, no. This isn't even close. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go. I can't get, oh, there's so many still coming. Oh no, these guys are gonna get caught. Oh, they're gonna get trapped. Oh no, they can still shoot them while they're running. Okay, go, 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 get out of there, guys. I guess they have shields, right? So they can still be defending, but. Oh, wow. That's, look at how many more were coming. Something went very wrong at one point there and I don't know what it was. Oh, we lost our pike too. Oh God, that's pretty much the worst. I thought we might've been okay for a second there. It looked like Now I just have, <laughs> oh, so now I just have to do that without a pike is basically all that it is because I have no choice. Oh God, okay. Well, I guess now is when we find out. I don't have enough to do any upgrades. And now I just have to bring Gemma. Oh, I've got no pikes. This is so brutal. It's so brutal. The thing is, I feel like if I had pikes still, I could, this could be like a, not an easy, uh, an auto win, but I could at least maintain this last house up top. Cause there's only one entry point. Oh, but now I'm just absolutely sewered if I'm not, I, like I almost have to just abandon let me just look quickly here. So that's, this is nothing. That, that isn't anything. If they land over here, they have to come around, all the way around. So there really is, there is only one entry point, which I guess is something. God, I have no pikes though. Like what do I, I don't know what I'm supposed to do about these big guys, except for maybe, like I said, I, like I maybe just have to sack this house and just let it die, because I don't know if there's anything I can do. I have to be super, super strategic. That did not do what I thought it was gonna do. That really did not do what I was hoping it was gonna do. Fucking kidding me, oh my God. Can they even get up there? Are they just dead? Just dead. Yeah, literally everybody's dead now again, except for my absolutely wretched. And now they're just stuck up here. That's, I guess that's the thing is that you can't, you can't harbor people up here because, because they just, there's no, there's no saving them if something goes wrong. This could be okay if we're somehow just able to hold this spot. It might not be that bad. But 
because I just don't think it's possible. Oh, and I just killed, absolutely killed myself with my own mines, so there's that too. Which is great. <laughs> oh, just absolutely abysmal. Just abysmal. Fuck, it's over. It's over. I don't know what I, what could I have done differently. I mean, there's a million things I could have done differently, but look at this. Two stupid archers, as if that's going to do anything for me. I don't even know if either of them have their ability. They don't. Neither of them have the volley. Oh, God. It's just over, right? Like, deploying, I, I have to win here, but it doesn't mean anything. <sighs> well, I guess this gives meaning to last stand or whatever. <laughs> just gonna have to kite. Play the kiting game for two minutes and... Like, they're not even shooting yet. This is brutal. I'm not even going to get close. They have to kill everyone before they touch ground. Okay, so I got to move them staggered. So that one is always moving back while the other is shooting. <laughs> That's kind of how it's got to go. That's not bad. Okay. Okay, one wave down. <laughs> now the problem is is that now I have to kill these guys completely from scratch while everybody else joins in. <laughs> now they're already on top of us. <laughs> that was going like mildly well for a second. You know, for the one wave that I had. Yeah. Nothing that I could do. Oh, if I just, if only I had the pike, if only I didn't lose the pike in that one, if I was able to flee with them. Oh, I think I might have been okay on this one, because really, pikes can hold ground for so long. I don't want a checkpoint. I don't know. Brutal. I'm glad I didn't say anything. I thought for a minute, I was like, you know, this is going well. As long as I don't do anything monumentally stupid, I'll probably finish this run. And uh, there, I, there I go. I went ahead and did something monumentally stupid. So that's that, folks. Thanks for tuning in. I'm not done with this game, obviously. I uh, want to beat it at least once, and then it'd be cool to try hard mode out. But um Obviously a way more successful run than our first one. Is this only our second? This is only our second run. I got 97% of the way there, so... I feel good about it. I what, did I what do I need to do in the future? I need to make sure I'm always, 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 always protecting a pike. I absolutely must have a pike, basically at all costs. Um, like, if I have pikes and elite archers, there's a chance I can hold that top part of the... Of the... Uh, of that final battle with two units um, and at least get a passing grade. Even better if my if my archers have mines and stuff like that, they can run down and like rig up the path as uh, and then run back. But anyways, those are lessons for next run. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for stopping by. I post videos Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So if you had fun, if you enjoyed watching this, uh, you can subscribe and expect three videos a week on those days that I mentioned. Bye. <laughs>